but uh, only three plays could be nominees for our Game of the Year. The nominees for Game of the Year are Holiday Over Jacksboro Softball. On April the 26th, the Holiday and Jacksboro softball teams met to determine which team would enter the playoffs as the district's top seed. What ensued was pure excitement. Jacksboro took a 3-0 lead in the third, Holiday responding with a five-run fourth inning. The teams were tied 5-5 going to the seventh, both teams scoring a run to force extra innings. Holiday eventually won in the ninth when the Lady Eagles ended the game by turning their third double play of the game. Jacksboro over Merkel softball. On May 7th, Jacksboro met Merkel in the area round of the playoffs. Alex Holman pitched her way into the state record books by throwing 191 pitches and striking out an astonishing 32 batters. The two teams scoreless heading into the 14th inning when both teams pushed a run across the plate. But Jacksboro didn't make Tigerette fans wait long to celebrate Hadley Richardson delivering a walk-off game winner in the 15th. Windforce over Mark Football. The Mark Panthers were heavy favorites to win a fourth straight state championship on December 16th. But when the teams went to halftime tied at 14, many at AT&T Stadium believed an upset was brewing. Mark led by seven with four minutes, 11 seconds to go. The Trojans orchestrated a 13-play, 75-yard drive, which included two fourth-down conversions. And with 26 seconds on the clock, Cy Belcher scored, and then the Trojans went for two. Ethan Belcher trotting into the end zone and shocking football fans across the state as Windsor held on to win 22-21. The nominees for Game of the Year, Holiday over Jacksboro Softball. Jacksboro over Merkel softball. Winthorpe over Mark football. The award for 2021 Game of the Year goes to the Winthorpe Trojans for their state championship victory over Mark. Come on, Chris Tackett. He sat at his table like he was embarrassed to come up, but he enjoys this. Coach, leading up to this game against Mart, you heard the rumblings. Mart was going to win another state championship. Not many outside of Winthorpe were giving the Trojans a chance. They were wrong. Yeah, I mean that was that was kind of fine with us. Uh, you know, that's just the way we went into it, and we knew we knew we belonged in that game. And you know, I think it showed by the way we went out there and played. And, and they're a very good team, but we, uh, you know, we hung it on them. That, uh, that, that drive at the end, um, how much fun was that to, to watch and enjoy <laughs> as a coach? It must have been stressful, too. Better to watch it right now, but it, <laughs> at the time, you can enjoy it a little more. But it was, uh, I mean, it was, you know, I think that's in uh, all those guys' DNA. I mean, they were, they were calm and cool, and, and uh, they knew it was time to get the job done, and that's what they did. Congratulations. Thank you.